Hey y'all, this is Brett, and today I would like to tell you why I think that George and John are dead and why Paul and Ringo are still alive. And it's something that I really need to work on in my life. And to understand the different personalities of the Beatles is so hugely helpful for a lot of us. And if you've watched the videos of them on YouTube, if you've read about them or you just have an understanding for them, then you know that John and George were more serious about things. I mean, George wrote, My sweet Lord, I really want to see you, Lord. And he said in one video that I watched that he only felt comfortable in his garden. And um, I feel largely the same way. But when you go in the garden, it gives you a connection back to the earth, the mother. And, um, and John always had an agenda <laughs> to fill, you know. He was trying to change the world. And in another video, he, uh, he said to Paul that he, he thinks that we really changed the world. And... Um, but I went to the Paul McCartney concert the other night and you could just feel how easy going Paul was. Not a care in the world and just able to take things with a grain of salt. And we've all seen how, for the most part, Ringo is just kind of the, the funny man. <laughs> he wants to be funny. And humor is such a huge thing in life and staying healthy and this world that we live in is so complex and there are so many troubles out there and you have to know yourself and you have to know what you can take on and you can take on as much as you want to and if you've got it within you then do but then when you need to take care of yourself then just put up the force fields and spend some quiet time with yourself. Be with people that can really help you. Keep watching my videos. <laughs> and, um, you know, a lot of us love the Beatles. And I'm glad that Paul is still uh, kicking and George or Ringo too and God bless George and John and God bless you be well